everyone, welcome back to another video. My name is Winty Lee, and this is my Happy Holidays video. Right now, I'm going to be building a gingerbread house. So we have graham crackers, we have marshmallows, kiss chocolates, Skittles, M&Ms, and we have sweet tarts. I also have frosting. <laughs> okay, let's get started. I'm kind of nervous. Let's roll up my sleeves. Oh, y'all ain't ready. You see this? Christmas sweater. Okay, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna glue the pieces of gingerbread to the base so that it won't fall while I'm building the other things. Okay, let's break these. Oh, those are easy to break. Oh, I didn't even break it in the middle. Are you joking? Oh, let's start gluing. Okay. I was able to get two up. There's one right here, which is in the front, and then there's one in the back that's attached to it, and I'm holding it up with this while it's drying. And I'm gonna try to make a door for one of them. I feel like that would be cute, no? Yeah? Okay, I'm gonna use a knife, because I don't know how else to do this. I think the way to do it would be like just cutting two straight lines, popping that piece out, and then wherever the line ends for the top, then I'll carve it into a more circular shape so it looks like a door. Don't break it in half. Okay, broken half. On to the next one. Oh! I broke this one too. That's good. I'm gonna carve it to make it like more circular. Oh! I can just glue this back together, no? I'll get back to you when this is done drying. I was able to assemble one, two, and then three. The last piece for this four is going to be this. I want to cut a marshmallow and make it into a couch. I'm using this as like a seat, to, like a pillow seat. <laughs> Look at my chair. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put it in here. Oh, this kind of looks like a toilet, doesn't it? That's okay. It's a sofa. I grabbed a piece of tofu because I'm hungry. This is taking a lot of my energy. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna cut a tree out of this. Like this broken cracker, I'm gonna shape it into a tree. See? Improvisation. It's a skill. I was gonna continue that sentence, but it's a skill sounds good. Oh! I broke it again. No worries. We can just use this tiny piece. I think that's good enough for a tree shape. That's pretty good. Okay, now I'm going to take the green M&Ms and glue that on. Them on. Isn't that so smart? I'm so intelligent. Okay, I'm taking like globs of dried frosting because that'll dry faster. And I'm going to stick them on. Fire! Fire! Okay, now I'm gonna wait for it to dry. I'm gonna actually start decorating now, so things are gonna get serious. So I'm gonna time lapse it because it's gonna take a while, unfortunately. Look at my tree, it even leans a little, isn't that? Let's time lapse it. One, two, three. everyone it is finished let's show you guys the final product welcome to bearlandia this is the overview drone view and this is uh bear view so first you know it's snowing in bearlandia we got the icing on the bottom and then icing on the house because those are icicles and it's snowing as always and it's dirty snow it's not clean snow it's dirty snow you made with the crushed graham crackers when i was carving out the graham crackers so next we have this welcome mat and bear number two is standing on the welcome mat bear number two is holding a green 
present for bear number one. What could it be? What could it be? It is probably fish. So we have this wreath, which is a smash skittle that I peeled the insides out of. So it's a wreath shape. Then we have some cut in half skittles and M&Ms to be decorations on top. They're, imagine them as lights, maybe. Then we have bear number one. Either they are sitting on the toilet or they are sitting on a couch. I will leave it up to your imagination. Lastly, we have bear number three. Bear number three is plugging in the cord to light up the tree and success. We have the tree, M&Ms covered, and then a yellow skittle on top as a star. Ain't it beautiful? And now we're gonna be wrapping some presents. I have four baby boy cousins and we're giving them all sweatshirts that will look like this. They'll all be matching, so it'll be so adorable. I'm gonna use The, the sweaters are kind of fake. Oh! I to the next activity. I'm gonna paint my nails. Uh, I went to church yesterday, so I like rush painted my nails with a base coat of white just to look clean, you know? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do designs that just cover up the chipping so I don't have to paint them again. So on the, what is it? This like wheelie thingy, I have some nail stuff. And then I'll make red. I apologize if the audio on this video is just because uh, I tried recording with my camera and I don't know the audio seems a little like right now I have to be kind of quiet because my dad is sleeping so Because the brush is kind of textured, it kind of gives it a textured look. Now it looks like I got my period, but on my nail. This finger looks pretty dry, so I'm going to put the star on first. Okay, I'm just going to do like a little ornament thing. Cute. Okay, completed. I don't know if I've told y'all in this video yet. I improvised, um, <laughs> I emphasized improvising a lot during this video because I used to be the biggest perfectionist. Like, everything had to be, like, a certain way. Like, when I do things for myself, they need to be the way I want them. Otherwise, it needs to be done again. But then I realized, you know, over quarantine, life isn't perfect and a lot of the time things are not going to go the way you want but the best thing to do from there is to adapt to the situation and grow from it you know so improvise when things go wrong improvise one line <laughs> it does look like a child drew it <laughs> okay now I'm going to do the little bow on top. 
So, oh, see? Hey, it's not too bad. It's cute. Okay, let's wait for them to dry and I'll show you all the finished product and the pair together. Cute! Hi everyone, welcome to the next section of the video and now I will be decorating my room. Um, I'm actually not Winty. I am Winty's friend. I am reindeer. Uh, I'm going to show you guys really quickly what I have to decorate Winty's room. First, we have this snow globe. It shakes up like that. And we have a picture of Winty, her sister, and Santa. This was taken at the mall many years ago, and Winty doesn't remember when it was taken, but a long time ago. And it plays a little music. Next, we have this piece, and it just says Merry Christmas with a little L. And then we have this Holly Jolly Christmas frame. Very simple, simplistic. I also have this mm, Christmas kind of plate, and it says Merry, and then it also has a snowman. I'll incorporate it somehow. I don't know how yet, but we'll find a way. It also is from Hallmark, in case anyone is interested. <laughs> and then we have some Christmassy holiday themed fairy lights and they have these little red jingle bells. Then we have this ornament that my aunt gave to my family. Let me put it in my room. It's just a photo of Santa and I back in 2007. I'm lacking in the decoration department. I'll be honest. However, I'm hoping that this cute wrapping paper will make up for it. <laughs> so that's it. Let's get into decorating. First thing I'm going to hang up is uh, are these things on this wall. This wall is very blank. I think I'm going to put this one here. we have is this ornament right here hanging in between my closet doors then we have this section right here by the mirror oh i'm about to bump into the stand oh we also have this photo of santa and i right here next to the mirror then moving over to this wall we have the merry christmas elf and holly jolly christmas on the wall here literally surrounded by nothing i decided to put the plate on my table because if i put it up anywhere else it would most likely fall and break and that is dangerous lastly we have the snow globe on top of my bed frame oh not lastly i'm joking the fairy lights with the little jingle bells all right y'all into the next section and now we're going to be writing christmas cards okay so this is the cabinet that's usually filled with supplies um, and also snacks. So, uh, we're definitely gonna need some just regular pen and paper. I'll use pens. So, luckily, I found this cardstock. Okay, so now we have our five base cards, and what I'm planning to do is on the blank side, I'm going to paint something um, meaningful to the family. Family, they're literally all my family members. And then on this side, I'm going to put a piece of printer paper, and then I'll write my message for them. Alright everyone, 
I'm just gonna paint uh, the cards now. So I'm gonna speed it up for y'all. Enjoy this Christmas music. Scarves and sweaters bundled up in cotton Knowing names that wouldn't be forgotten Laughing over our own sense of humor Underneath the Christmas lights that Christmas time again And even though we both get busy We still have time to talk for It is 9.42 and everything is dry now I was editing this video While I was waiting for this stuff to dry Then I was doing some history notes Because I need to catch up Now I'm going to write the holiday messages I'm glad I got to know so far since that December I would have known I would have made my best friend on that night under a thousand Christmas lights lights anyways I can't wait to give this to my family members I'm gonna show y'all my Christmas tree this switch oh <laughs> i forgot to tell you guys our tree is mechanical it moves and yeah that's our tree hi everyone it's christmas morning yay i'm so tired but if you watched up until this point thank you so much if you're not already subscribed make sure to click the subscribe button turn on post notifications so you can get a notification every time i post a new video comment down below if you enjoyed this video and click the thumbs up button make sure to also follow me on my instagram at winty b lee and happy holidays to you and your family and a happy new year too thank you so much for watching this video i love you oh i just pointed the knife in my face dangerous put it down so this oh.